This is a quick little kit bash of Sabretooth. This little project's just a quick little kit bash I did while I was working on other projects. So it's like, I got the Bone Breaker Wave. I wasn't crazy about the body they used. This head is huge on the Grip Hero body. And I had the modern, more modern style Puck Wave Saber 2 for a long time. I wasn't crazy about either one of them, but combined together, they make a pretty cool looking figure. It's a quick little no paint kick bash, a little bit of dremeling. The only dremeling I had to do was for the fur pieces on the lower legs. Everything else was a heat and pop swap. Swapped out the head, put the fur piece from the Bonebreaker Wave onto the uh, Hopperian uh, based uh, modern uh, saber tooth. Our forearms were easy heat and pop swap. Uh, same with the hands and the feet. The only thing I had to Dremel out was the, the fur pieces that's on the uh, saber, uh, Bonebreaker Wave. Took my Dremel, hollowed them out. Took, took the heat and uh, they were glued onto the le lower legs of the Bonebreaker Wave one. And so I just heated and popped those off and took my Dremel tool and with a barrel bit and hollowed them out to fit on the Hyperion style uh, lower legs. Sometimes you don't really need to do too much to make a cool looking custom. I repaint the teeth. Digital face printing for some reason left these specks all over the teeth. I end up repainting those white or like off white. It's weird when you looked up really close it's like grainy like, te uh, like textured like on the teeth. So just quick little hit with a uh, little bit off white made those look better. Anyway, thanks for taking the time to watch the video. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch y'all next time.